either, either, man. You know, you guys ain't you guys ain't banging in here. I'm sure I'm not banging in there. But uh, hey, sharpshooter, can you hear me? So I can hear you real good. Uh, 205 sharpshooter from the Worldwide DX Forum over here on uh, Cape Kennedy, Florida. Back to you. Right, on that, man. Well, I'll post you up. I'll post this video. I'll actually uh, post you up, man. Do you see uh? Usually I just post them on my YouTube. I used to post them on the forums a lot of the time. I used to post a post the whole mess of man, but I know people probably get tired of probably tired of hearing all that DX in my radio there, Roger. <laughs> Always a pleasure watching the videos there. You know, like I was telling you before, uh, I uh, had the pleasure of a uh, uh, 148 there in there out of the last but I finally was able to uh, catch up to him, and uh, we had real good contact with him the other day. And then uh, the 399 JJ, uh, you know, down there in uh, South America, uh, he's been booming in here lately. So uh, hey, we've had a, a pretty good, and then, of course, you, the uh, 4040 there, uh, we've had a, a great uh, contact with the uh, rest of the forum members there. So it's been a great time. Yeah, Roger and that, man. Yeah, I get to... Uh I've just been lucky out here. We've been having some real good conditions out here. I've been uh, talking to a whole mess of people from forums. All the different forums, man. So I, we've just been blessed out here, man. Just been blessed to have all these conditions, man. So, yeah, it's kind of cool, man. I got to talk to guys from uh, all the forums. Seems like the guys from all the different forums, man. All the WWPDX guys, the worldwide guys, uh... Uh, shoot, man, uh, what's that other form? The Char even Charlie Tango guys, you know, the long-distance boys. It's, uh, it's all good, man. It's all good in the hood. I love, I love to talk to the guys on the radio and then show them the water gates there on the forum there, Roger. Make copy that 100%. Yeah, your radio sounded great over here on the East Coast of Florida. Are you still running the Game Master there? Yes, sir, man. Love my Game Master. Love my little game master. This thing's, I call it my whooping stick there, Roger. Hey, Roger, on that guy, yeah, I, uh, I have noticed that one of the questions over on the, uh, the Sparky CB on their form, uh, one of the guys was asking about the game master there and where it's high in it. Uh, uh, the one of the replies I want to close to was the uh, H and Y there. So, uh, yeah, was, that made me think if uh, you were still running that or not. I didn't know if you were just experimenting with it or uh, you going to keep it or what. Yeah, man, I'm... I really love that antenna. I'm actually use it over my beam. I found the beam every now and then to have a little more gain, but not even that much more gain over my four element. Uh, but you know, sometimes you know how it is. Usually in the cold weather, man, the difference. Usually the omnis really stoke up pretty good in the uh, the winter time. So we'll see this summer, man. I'll fire up my beam a little more, but I've been kind of been lazy, man kind of nice to have this antenna just uh <laughs> just sitting there uh you know what i mean you don't have to swing it or nothing there roger hey copy that 100 percent yeah on this end I'm, I'm still running the uh high max yeah i don't i don't have it very high i've only had the c point about 18 and a half feet so uh, i have pretty good luck with it no doubt about it uh, let me get some other guys follow the shot here any other guys in here uh 266 243 or 4020 oh i'm sitting right here Go ahead and jump in there, because he's got the video gate going. Hey, 4040, uh, this is 4020, 4020, Cocoa Beach, how you doing? Yeah, Roger, on that 4020. Yeah, I'll post this up, and uh, old sharpshooter, he'll, he'll get the link, and he'll send it to you. He'll send you the link, so you could uh, check this video out. You'll see what you're doing out here. Hey, QSL, QSL. Yeah, Mark was going to give me that link. Uh, I haven't gotten it to it yet. I think the uh, patch at 266 out there in Orlando has that link, too, there. I don't have it yet, so uh, they haven't given it to me. I guess I'm not on the uh, on the uh, need-to-know list. That's what I was going to say, man. You just, uh, you're not a key guy, man. <laughs> you don't know the secret handshake yet. No, I haven't gotten that. I haven't gotten that secret handshake yet. There. I don't know. Maybe it'll come around. You never know. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah, I hear you, 4020. Man, I, you started creeping up about 9S units right there. Sounds like maybe Mother Nature will start coming back to us here. Well, you never know what she does, like my motto is. She'll give you wings, and then she'll take them away. Oh, yeah. That's the way she works, man. We've been, we've been pretty blessed out here, man. We've been having just Mother Nature every day. It's just been so nice, man. It's just been nice, and... I really got to, man, I got to talk to uh, Ireland and England and 
I mean, you know, I'm making the long hump around, man, going all the way across the United States out there. So, you know, like Australia for me is easy, like you guys talking to England and that. Because, you know what I mean? That's kind of just a short hop across the water. But uh, to go all the way across the U.S. to talk to the U.K., now that's, that's, that's doing some business. Yeah, QSL on that. Yeah, I talked a little bit of Finland today there and a little bit of Australia, but uh, there was just uh, just too much traffic on there to, to have any kind of a lengthy conversation, although I did uh, get to talk to Finland for a little while there for about 15 minutes on uh, on uh, Channel 39 there, so that was that was kind of a treat in itself. Yeah, Roger on that. I just hate it when, uh, when I get out there and, you know, I love, love talking to the guys in the States, but, you know. Boy, I get a million of them. They just start calling me and just, you got to weed through all the mess. Yeah, QSL, QSL. And uh, what kind of radio are you running over there? Yeah, this is uh, Yezu FT2000D. Yezu FT2000D there, Roger. Yeah, QSL. Now, I had a little bit of a debate going on there. Um, did the, uh, the 2000s came out after the, uh, the, uh, the 1000s, right? Yeah, I'm 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 not a hundred percent positive on that, but uh, I I would believe so. But I I don't know for sure, man. To to make a statement on that. Yeah, QSL, QSL. Well, it's a nice sound in 2000D. Uh, sounds great out here. So, uh, um, <clears throat> yeah. What kind of audio gear are you running on that? Yeah, I'm running uh I'm running a RE20 microphone, which is a uh, a broadcast microphone. They have them at most of your local radio stations. And I'm running uh, Pro Tools. Running some uh, Pro Tools into this thing. Hey, Roger. Hey, QSL. So you got that baby wired into the computer. Oh, yeah. Got a dedicated computer for it. I'm not a Mac guy, you know what I mean? I'm not a Mac computer guy. Well, I mean, you know, I got an iPhone and that whatnot. But I definitely uh, bought a computer just to, just to run my audio. QSL was well, nice sounding, nice sounding. So uh, anyway, I'll let you get back to Mark here. I wanted to say hello to you and uh, looking forward to hearing that on uh, on that uh, that site there. Yeah, Roger on that. Yeah, it'll be all posted up on YouTube, man. I'll uh, I'll send a sharpshooter the link. He can send it to you. Maybe late at night he could play it to you over the radio. <laughs> All right there, 4040, you have a good one. It's a pleasure talking to you. 73 to you from 4020, Cocoa Beach. We're gone. QRT, bye-bye. All right, 4020. Yeah, you got Scott on this end. All right, 4020, yeah, real good copy, man. Uh, you're definitely going like, to uh, like what you're seeing in my radio. Plus, you know, uh, the receive on these things. You know, these things are sweet, man. Transmit and receive. Yeah, QSO. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm talking on an FT1000MP, uh, the Mark V, but... Uh, I don't know if it has a receive at those 2000s. I hear those uh, 2000s have better receives. Yeah, I can go pretty damn wide. Well, a little four. Does it go out about four and a half or so? Which kind of sucks. I wish it went out a little further. But hey, it is what it is. I'm not complaining too much, man. The reason I bought this radio is for this cycle. You know what I mean? To do some long distance talk. Usually I'm a big AM guy, but this radio here, I can have that AM sound on sideband. Right there, 4040. I'll let you get back to uh, the sharpshooter over there. 4040, it's always a pleasure, and hope we can hook up again on the airway there. 4020, Cocoa Beach. We're going to be QRT. Bye bye. Roger, Roger. 4020. Come on in here. Who else is out there? All right, 266. Yeah, Mother Nature's kind of falling out on you, Captain Bigger. Mother Nature's kind of falling out on you a little bit. All right, 266. Take care, man. You and 420. Y'all have a beautiful uh, St. Patty's Day. And I'll post this thing up right now for you, man. I'll post it up right now for you. Roger, Roger. Well, we appreciate it. You take care. Like I said, it's always good to talk to you. Talk to you later, 266. Back wide. Roger, Roger. 266. 4040. Out in the beautiful. Great shakies of Cali. Working this old Yakimo. And 
and I'm gone now. Bye, sharpshooter. I'll post that video up, man. Show all your buddies. Send them the link now. You hear? Will do, will do. Hey, happy St. Patty's Day there, Scott. Take care. Yeah, happy St. Patty's Day right back, man. Happy St. Patty's Day right back. I've already had a couple shots. Starting on a beer. Thinking about another shot. I hope I can make it till dinner. <laughs> I hope I can make it to dinner, man. But uh, if not, man, hey, y'all take care out there. Sharpshooter, go with six and 420. Man, you guys sound good. From Florida to California, y'all got to pat yourself on the back, man. That's, that is kind of a hump, especially uh, we don't have the best mother nature. Take care. 4040's is in the clear. Take care, 4020. 205, the sharpshooter, Kate Kennedy. Bye-bye. Click, click. That's pretty cool. I, w I wish Chris had followed us down here. I said I wish uh, 243 Chris had followed us up here. Yeah, that would be cool if we could talk to him. I caught the tail end of it. I was rolling out. It was rolling out as I got to talk to him. Right. Uh, you know, earlier in the day, he could, uh, he, or uh, earlier in the conversation there on the 385, uh, he, could, he could hear you in there, but, uh, man, just a world of traffic. Oh, yeah. I heard him come back to me, but uh, there were just so many people in there that I couldn't. Uh, they were covering him up, and uh, I know they were covering me up, too, so I just, just threw my hands up and said, hell with it, you know? What the hell? Them boys are covering me up. You should have let me know. I'd have gotten a damn pump house on them. I still got the email, so I'll send it your way. Yeah, I still got it. What's that, 4040? I said, if the boys were getting in my Kool-Aid, you got to let me know, because I got a pump house over here. I just normally talk barefoot, but I got a pump house. I could put it right on the backside. Oh, well, I should let you know, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, it was, just, it was just such a mess, man. I heard you coming back to me, and... Uh, you know, with this old FT-101 I got, man, I can only do so much, eh, Roger? Yeah, I love those FT-101s, man. I love them uh, FT-101s. That's a, that's a great radio. Man, Those uh, there's a couple mods out there, man. There's a couple mods out there if you're interested in it, man. You know, you can widen the receiver out, and you can get that transmit to a sound like broadcast quality, man. Oh, yeah. I sure would like to get them, that's for sure, uh... Uh, I don't think the conditions are holding long enough for me to get them, though. Yeah, well, uh, Grasshopper's the guy you got to get a hold of, man. He's on the WWPDX forum. Old Grasshopper, man, he's, he's got the mods. I think a couple other guys got the mods. They could send them to you. It's just a couple dollars in parts, man. Ain't, ain't really all that expensive, but I'll tell you what, it'll turn that, uh, those FT radios into to broadcast radios. Roger on that. Well, I guess I'm going to try to see if I can't look it up and uh, look under mods for this thing. I imagine they're probably there somewhere there, Roger. Yeah, Roger on that. Yeah, they got to transmit, to widen the transmit out and widen the receiver out. And those, uh, dude, I've had a lot of one-on-ones, man. And, you know, every time I get rid of one, you know, someone hears me on a radio, 4040, come on, let me buy that radio off you. Let me buy that radio. They'll bug me to death, and then I'll just get rid of it, you know. <laughs> but I tell you what, man, I'm 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 always in the market for another 101. I like the 101E e myself, but uh, they are uh, they are some fun radios. Well, that's what I got. I got an FT 101E, and I got the FL 2100B for it, and uh, I got the uh, digital display that goes to it, and the uh, patch and speaker. Go ahead. Roger on that, man. Well, I tell you what, man, you could just like the phone patch in the back. I mean, you can get you a little mixer. And just get you a get you a mixer and a and a nice microphone, and you can hook that right into there. And I tell you just the difference between that, you know what I mean? Than regular running a regular microphone, that'll blow you away, man. Wow! Wonder where I could get that uh, set up at. I'm gonna look around and see what kind of uh, 